Hello, and welcome back to The Sim. In this one, we're hopping in with the Cessna 172 because now that we've got the new 530 and we want to go play around with it, perfect plane. However, we have a problem. We haven't flown this thing since we added our new Boeing yoke. But that's okay because now with SPAD.next in version 9.2, there is actually a new feature uh, which we're going to explore and that's how do you import a device from another profile. So let's go ahead, jump in this bad dex and get started. So here I've got my profile. Now previously the way to get my joystick in would have been to simply go into another profile, load it up, copy the device, then come back, load this profile and paste it. However, that takes some time and there is now a new feature. So if we come into our joysticks and I go to my TCA yoke, right, this does have some of the events on it, but it doesn't match what I have in my Kodiak. So what I want to do is head over to the drop down and now what you're going to find is an import feature. So when we click on import, it opens up a dialog and you can look through all of your other uh, profiles. So here I can go to my Kodiak and I can grab the default, which is the only uh, thing for this device over there. I'm going to hit select and it's gonna go ahead and it has imported everything. Now, what's really nice about this is as you can see, it merges the actions. So it has not replaced everything. If I wanted to do a replacement, I could do it the previous way, which was to go into that other profile, copy the entire device, come back to this profile, and then under paste, it would then prompt me. Replace, no means merge or cancel, don't do anything. So here, this is great because I wanted the pressed and released and the old events were involving a short press. So now I can go through and I can clean up events that I don't want from that joystick. So that's it, this one's a real quick one. I just wanted to give you a chance to see exactly what the import feature does and how it's now accessible to everyone. Well. If you made it this far, please go ahead, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and come along on the next one. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great day.